Peter Parker. What have you been up to? I do some web design. Superhero fans, get prepared to be webbed. Director Mark Webb and his team definitely have a reason to cheer, as there will be enough jingle at the cash windows. Though the film is overly long, has way too many villains and a few jumbled up plot lines, it still makes up for a fun textbook comic superhero movie. However, what it loses in plot, it gains in momentum of action sequences and solid performances by its lead pair. Not to forget the jaw-dropping VFX scenes. The story revolves around Peter Parker, played brilliantly by Andrew Garfield, who promises to stay away from his girlfriend Gwen, enacted by the ever-charming Emma Stone. The only problem being, he just can't keep his word. Garfield and Stone make the screen light up every time they are together. And that's where the film's strength lies. In the meanwhile, Spider-Man rescues a needy scientist played by Jamie Foxx who works for the Oscorp and believes only Spidey can save him. There's also a backstory about Peter Parker's parents and why they abandoned him as a child. What works for the film are its leads, solid performances all around and some great chemistry. Not to forget the aerial VFX which makes you hold your seat tighter. It's also amazingly emotional. If the plot has you confused, the number of climaxes will make you swoon. The film ends promising a sequel. All Spider-Man fans out there, your money is totally worth it. What? What, what are you doing? What am I doing? I'm doing, I'm doing my laundry. laundry. I, last time you did it, you turned everything blue and red. Because I was washing the, 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 the American flag, my, my flag. No one washes the flag.